Okay. So I disassembled the um, channel mount servo just so I could realign the um, this little bracket on the bottom. Reason why is because when I looked at this, the square pattern that we have here was actually diagonal um, on the servo itself. So if I placed it on there, uh, the actual rotunda would be um, at an angle. So I just reoriented it. It's not perfect, which is the reason why our neutral, our neutral, our frequent, our neutral period, our channel width, our pulse width is um, 1,475 microseconds. That should be perfectly fine. Um, and I'm going to show you at five volts and with the rotunda uh, what the other um, uh, what the max mins look like. The ma the minimum is actually 830. Put this down for a sec. Eight three zero microseconds. And you can see the rotunda go. Only drawing around 10 million or 100 milliamps. Okay. And now I'm going to go to the next one, which is 2130. So 130 microseconds. I'm gonna go all the way around. And that's our um, biggest sweep on the other side. So we actually have quite a bit of um, range with our, um, with our tender. And mind you, this is only at five volts. We won't actually be powering at five volts. We'll most likely be powering them by, at around uh, 8.4. Someone's just gonna do one little I test. I'm going to bring it up to 8.4 volts. And I'm going to see how fast this guy moves in comparison. So I'm going to disconnect five, the 5 volts. It doesn't really matter which one you power on first since it's just one little circuit. And I hear the relay switching. 8.4. Okay. All right, so now we're going to go to... 830 microseconds. Oops. And look at it go. So now that's pretty darn fast. Get it back into neutral real quick, and then I'll call it done. Four, seven, five microseconds. And yeah, a little off a bit, but yeah, that's pretty much what we got. Um, cheers.